hey guys welcome back to my channel so today's video i will be talking about my weight um it's been a few weeks since i actually mentioned how much i've um lost and my current weight right now so i'm going to give you guys all the details right now um i've been kind of dreading this video because i kind of had bad news for you guys and then i didn't really want to share them but i was like i, I have to do it so <sighs> so the week before i started the challenge i actually um as you guys saw my video of the day before the challenge i was drinking i had tamales um i i i ate really really bad that day so i actually was eating out the whole week because i didn't prep any meals for that week because i was like it's okay i'm gonna do this challenge let me just not stress over how i'm eating right now so i was eating out probably every single day of the week uh, i had two family graduations that week so um, i did go to buffalo Wings during the week i went to applebee's during the week um i went to chipotle which i never eat bad at chipotle i get myself a salad but um just to you know basically show you or tell you guys what i was eating throughout the week i went to blaze pizza uh, where else did I go to? I went to Olive Garden uh, Which I think I showed that on my snap. I think I went on the day before um, I think I went like on a Saturday, but yeah, so I had all those I went to eat to all those places during the week uh, I had a beer the weekend before that too because it was my cousin's baby shower and i was like let me enjoy my beer because i'm not going to be able to for the next six weeks right so i did so bad that whole week and i actually <laughs> oh, i'm sorry guys i actually gained about five pounds that week and uh my weight's always been like that i can lose my weight if i'm like determined i'll lose the weight pretty quickly um i mean i think anyone is as long as you try you you know you're gonna lose the weight but i gain it super fast especially and i i mean there's times where i don't but since that whole week normally i'll treat myself to one cheat meal or a cheat day but that whole week i was just eating out that whole week i was drinking beer uh beer is just not my body's friend although i love it so much but it's you know it's not so i i do gain weight when i drink too much beer which i was doing those two weekends um so i did gain about five pounds the the scale from the camp transformation center is different from the one from the gnc so at, at the camp it i'm actually probably a, close to two pounds over than i am at my house or at the gnc scale uh so if you look at it that way it's basically like i gained seven pounds which i didn't it's just the gnc i've been weighing myself at gnc and at the camp transformation center and it's always a pound or two off so just so you guys know i did not gain seven pounds i gained about five and um yeah so that's my bad news uh good news is that i've lost those pounds um the first week of the camp so when i started at the camp i was 174.6 the last time i uh weighed myself at gnc I was uh, 167.7 so that's the lowest I had been all year right um, that was the most recent one which was May 19th so at the camp unfortunately I didn't weigh myself the day of um, the first weigh-in at the camp um, I mean I didn't weigh myself at GNC the first day that we got weighed in at the camp so I don't have that to show you the difference but the other days i i did go away myself just so you guys could see how it is uh different from you know they're just every scale is basically different so the first day i started at 174.6 <laughs> i know it's bad at the camp 
my first week i lost 2.3 pounds second week i lost 2.6 pounds which as of now totals a 4.9 pound loss i was 172.3 i don't mean to confuse you guys but i really want you guys to see how it different how it differs from the gnc scale to the transformation camp so the second week uh i mean my first weight loss i was 2.3 pounds less uh, i was 172.3 at the camp and then um so i was 172.3 but at gnc i was 170.4 pounds and then my second weigh in well third technically but second losing weight i was 169.7 at the camp and at gnc i was 168.6 so as you guys can see the first one's more like a two pound difference the second one's like a one pound difference from the scales just so you guys know that it is different uh from now on i'm i, I don't think i want to keep going to gnc right now uh, just because it's a hassle to have to go weigh myself and then um, I have to go to GNC when you know they're weighing myself there but just so you know on this video I'm explaining how it differs that way when I do my other videos you guys are aware of the difference so yeah right now as in like per the camp I am 169.7 it's actually Saturday I mean Sunday already my weigh-in was on Monday I have my next weigh-in tomorrow so I will be I will be updating you guys on that as well but I wanted to give you guys you know the bad news and the good news is that I lost the weight that I gained you know already uh, I'm not going to lie um, oh and then I weighed myself at my home scale per my home scale I've lost, I think, another pound this week, but I'm, I haven't been weighing myself. Um, it was just once that I weighed myself, so I don't know. Like, we'll figure it. I'll find out. Um, I don't want to stress over it because I've been stressing over this already for these weeks, these couple weeks. So you guys will find out on my next, um, my next update. I'm not gonna lie. I've, I have been feeling very, very discouraged. I just feel like I thought I was going to have a faster outcome with their meal plan since it's so strict and I am working out way more than I was before um, actually since I've only lost um, roughly two pounds since I've only lost about two pounds each week a little you know a little bit more than that uh, they had me at cardio we're on our third week we're well actually i'm already done completing it's sunday already so as of tomorrow we're going into week four and um they had me at cardio this week at least three to four times aside from already the workouts that we do at the camp so i did do that i went to the gym uh three times this week right after my workout and I got on the elliptical and I did about 30-40 minutes. I'm hoping that the results tomorrow just are good. And they, because I'm on the thin line where every day has been a battle for me. Where I'm like, you know what, screw this meal plan. I'm not trying to give up on the workouts because I do feel like they're helping. There's just days that I'm like, I feel very discouraged and... I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to do my own my own meal plan. I mean, I, like, I just feel like there's days where I'm like, well, my diet was helping me more than this meal plan, you know? So, I miss my green smoothies in the morning. I really, really do. So, it, it's been it's been very challenging. So, I, there's days that I'm, I'm really like, I'm not going to do their meal plan anymore. It's so strict. I have to be macro counting and it's just kind of annoying so every week i'm like okay i'm gonna give it another week i'm gonna give it another week and honestly i was like this week if it's not good i'm just going to change it up next week and do my own you know like do my smoothie in the morning and something healthy for lunch and dinner but um i'm kind of i just want to complete the challenge i don't want to there's a lot of people on our Facebook group page that we have that have said that um, 
they they had done already of various amounts of of challenges so they said that their first weeks they lost little to no weight at all and then out of nowhere at the end is when all their weight came off so it's definitely challenging and i just want to be honest with you guys i i don't want to be here and be like yeah it's easy you know and then when in reality i am struggling i am having such a hard time doing this and more because my diet is more uh strict than the one um that everyone else is doing no one else is macro counting it's just the vegan meal plan that you have to macro count they get to have unlimited veggies i don't get to have unlimited veggies which is what i love so it it, it gets a little frustrating and annoying to me but i I'm, I'm hanging on a thin line but i'm doing it i i'm gonna give it i'm gonna wait tomorrow and see what my results are and then hopefully just keep going with with the meal plan um that they gave me because i mean i'm already halfway done i might as well just you know complete it and we'll just see hopefully later down later down the the road on this challenge i do lose more i think adding cardio this week um has helped a little bit i don't see much of a difference in my body um however though i am starting to see more definition on my muscles like my arms my legs my stomach i feel like i'm starting to finally look more toned um like i said not too much of a difference i and and i regret not taking my own pictures at the beginning of the challenge i didn't unfortunately uh they have the ones at the camp they did take our day one pictures but you know we're wearing a t-shirt and some tights so I really regret not taking one where just, you know, my sports bra and my underwear or something like that. But I do have, I guess, pictures from before that I could probably compare it to once I complete the challenge. So I guess I try, I'll try to go based off of that so the scale is not torturing me too much because I already, I mean, I already know you shouldn't be so focused on the scale. But the fact that I'm not feeling much slimmer is what's frustrating me so just to give you guys um an update a little update of what's been going on with with me and my weight i also do have um some other good news to share um so just give me a second okay i'll be right back a few moments later oh, oh yeah well now it's like I'm wearing blue, so. <laughs> okay. I wanted to bring my partner in crime to share the good news with you guys. Hi! I'm pregnant. I'm just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. I'm, I'm surprised right there, too. <laughs> so, this whole time that i've been doing the challenge my sister has been doing it with me <laughs> well i mean i'm making it sound like it's like forever but these past three weeks yeah i, I barely started this diet. my sister didn't want to say anything at the beginning i just didn't want to throw it out there yet yeah i kept like when i was vlogging i kept saying we mm -hmm. instead of i so i kept having to like film it again because i would freaking like try to include her in it but I couldn't yet good news is that she joined me she's obviously doing the regular meal plan which is the chicken yeah, and all the other options like tuna and egg whites yeah so. I mean she doesn't like anything other than the chicken and the egg whites yeah. but she's been she's been doing it and she's been doing really really good so i want to show you guys i'm gonna put the clip on here of the first <laughs> my first uh, oh my vlog God. well the day i was explaining um the challenge which was the sunday before we started yeah and i showed her i purposely showed her um it was just a, a quick you know quick few seconds whatever i showed her that way i would be able to show you guys uh the after since i couldn't actually be like well this is how she looks now <laughs> so there you know everyone's gonna be like yeah. what do you mean so um yeah that's how she looked and she's been doing 
amazing like really really good i'm freaking jealous okay <laughs> like i'm over here like how are you losing so much weight so how much were you when you started okay so that sunday that we went to go do our weigh-in mm -hmm. i was 213 monday Wait. it was sunday oh we weighed in Oh, that's right. It was Sunday. We weighed 213 point. Like, I weighed 213 point something. But since me and my sister decided to be fat asses that day, we were like, we're going to go eat. And we're going to have our last. Like, I already good. told them how it's a fat ass. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, well. And I'm paying for it now. <laughs> so, on Monday, I weighed myself. And I actually had gained a pound. So, I was 214. And then... <clears throat> The first week, I I lost like weight, like I lost ten. It was ten point nine pounds. The first in week. one week. <laughs> yeah, it. I was my mind was blown itself. And then the second week, I only lost what was it point seven point seven. Five, I think no. It was point five. Yeah, I think it was. Yeah, because I remember you're like I only lost point five. I was pretty pissed because she I was, was pissed like... when she lost <laughs> ten point nine pounds the first freaking week. Well, I mean, in one week, <laughs> who does that? I have a lot of weight too, like a lot. No, of yeah, that. that's true. She did lose um a lot more weight. I mean, obviously she it she's been eating bad all year long she she just started this challenge yeah and so it's she's barely starting to eat healthy so it was a big difference for her body uh since she was doing very very bad very bad i was eating hot cheetos every day i was having buffalo wild wings olive garden you know all the good shit yeah <laughs> yeah so she did she was doing bad but she finally got back on track yeah now this week i actually it gets better it gets better i actually started losing weight again like i actually like pounds not ounces actually i actually started losing pounds i lost from uh 202 i went from 202 to 195.8 so it's a total of what like almost seven pounds yeah so. Well, we don't know the exact weight, so that's how much she weighed at our home scale yeah. today, 195.8, which is less, as I had explained earlier too, because of the GNC scale, our home scale is less from the one at the camp as well. So over there, she might be a little bit more. Like a pound more. Maybe a pound. We'll find out and we'll update you guys on our way in tomorrow, which should be exciting. I'm excited because I can finally share <laughs> our way ins together. <laughs> like it was killing me. I was like, oh, we're doing this together and I can't share it with you guys. But we were, she was actually trying to wait until the was, end of the uh, cleanse. The, but since I've been noticing like my body changing, like I was just like, I have to like throw it out there yeah. now. We're actually gonna show you guys right now a picture too from last week so um oh yeah my before and after yeah so she took a picture before she started the challenge and then she took one last week it was the day of the she's wearing her mexico jersey because it's the day of the game mm -hmm. and they're like they're side by side side by right? side yeah you'll see on here and the same angle and everything yeah and you can already tell the huge difference yeah. like in crazy. three weeks in two well that was two weeks right yeah that was two weeks two week difference right there it's exciting we're doing this together we're gonna look bomb af together yes we did it once before where we both like lost, lost. a lot of weight and but the thing is we weren't ever this heavy yeah we weren't we never got we never had to let go of ourselves like how we did this time it wasn't until she started that time that we both lost a lot of weight that she finally was like dressing cute yeah, like, like we were able to share clothes <laughs> although i hate sharing yeah, my clothes she hates it when she she goes into my closet and i'm just like oh yeah go for it <laughs> but oh like i go into her closet it's like a, the end of the world for me yep and i have to check what she gets because I'll be like, no, you can't wear that. Yeah. Or, okay, fine, I guess. <laughs> but it's not that I want to. I'm very greedy when it comes to my clothes. Her and my mom, though, like, they always try to get in my closet. That's I'm like, uh-uh. She has cute shit. Like, Buy your own shit. <laughs> Her and my mom, that's what I hate about, like, the good thing is my mom's also losing weight. 
My mom has lost, I think, 35 pounds. Yeah. And it's, like, crazy. She's done it, like, around the same time that, like, me and you started the... Yeah. yeah. And my mom, was. she's not working out. Like, uh, she has health issues, so she can't really work out, but she's been eating a lot healthier. Like, before, we would eat out all the time, and... You know, her and my dad would go to Jack in the Box all the time. To Denny's. To my, Denny's. Like, my mom would go to her doctor's appointment. My dad would go with her and, like, they'll go have breakfast without us. But yeah. Would, they would go out to eat a lot. Or, you know, would get pizza. They would get pizza. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, they were so eating really, really, really bad. And, <laughs> and then um, my dad, too, started gaining a little bit of weight. Yeah. And thankfully there has been no temptation in this house my parents just been eating fruit like they'll have their like carne or chicken with yeah. their veggies so it's been very very good in this house lately and yeah, we're hoping say, it stays like i can't that. say the same about work though oh yeah <laughs> work for you is another issue but you cheat i will cut your throat don't worry, Sam has me on fucking check too. <laughs> My sister Wait. has lost 17.2 pounds in total. Yeah. And we're only uh, we're only halfway through she the challenge. She basically won the challenge. Yeah. <laughs> You're supposed to lose 20 pounds in order to win. She has what? 2.8 pounds to go and she's she won. She gets her money back. <laughs> Me. I mean, like, can we roll over so to, me, to me? Yesterday, you guys, I was oh. dying to cheat. And not, I'm okay. I've already told you guys. Food wise, I don't care. I don't care about food. <laughs> alcohol wise, I don't care about sound. And like an alcoholic, I suffer when it comes to alcohol. And we went to this <laughs> restaurant yesterday to watch the game. And we've never been to that restaurant here in Bakersfield. It was really nice. It's called La Mina Cantina or something like yeah. that. We've passed by it, but we never like, we're like, oh, let's go. And it was cracking. We were like, it was like people were like, act, like the, everyone was drinking. Well, except for me and my sister, obviously. Yeah, but everyone was drinking. You'll just see the, the waiters passing with... A whole tray of micheladas, yeah, margaritas, the beer out. Like there was this one that was the mango with a uh, chamois that now that looked. Bomb. Yeah, they all look bomb, and I would tell my sister. She'd be like, like, "Oh, like one drink." Is it yeah, and, and I was like, and I'd be like, "Let me just have a vodka and I was tonic." Like, no, sis. Like no, like you. It's usually it's the other way around with us. Yeah. Like it's usually like me. I'm the one. It's like, come on, sister. She's like, no. But this time it was me. I was like, yeah. I was, I was like, no, her. sister. Like we can't. Like we're doing so good. Like we can't do this. Sister, you I could have had my vodka. I was like, trying to get a healthier option and get a vodka tonic and she didn't let me. She was like, nope, you, you can do this. And I was like, <laughs> so every time they would pass by with the drink, I was just like, <laughs> she looks, she looks I so looked sad. So I was like, I <laughs> wanted to cry right there. So, that, so yesterday I was like <laughs> freaking miserable because I couldn't have a drink. And then right after we went to the store. Yeah, to. And she was like. Oh my god, chips. Yeah, I oh was my like, god. What, what other thing did you I do? was like, I'm not a big Pop Tarts fan, but like, when I saw them, random, I was just like, yeah, I was just like, Pop Tarts. Oh my god, even the Pop Tarts look good. Yeah, so she was like, and I was like, stop, sister. And she was like, you already know food is my weakness. Yeah. <laughs> but of course, I didn't let her give in. Just I think it helps that we're like doing it together. Yeah. Even though when I do the second round, like I'm not well, you're you're going I'm vegan. Still be yeah, vegan that's healthy. true. But and I'm not gonna be vegan by then. Whole well, vegetarian. Yeah, I'm, I've been vegetarian, so you're I, still eating like on like it's, she's not eating meat. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you said it like you like you're like mm -hmm. no, I don't, I don't care. I don't miss meat. Well, yeah, she doesn't. Like last last week, they they had burritos and. I mean, it looks good and it smells good, but it's not that I crave it at all. I which crave is good. I crave my red meat. I'm not. I'm more of my red <laughs> meat the than first, the chicken. In the first week that that she lost the 10.9 pounds, we're in the car. Oh, we went to GNC to go get weighed because we wanted to like see the difference of the scale from the camp to the to GNC. And she was in the car like super happy, right? Because she lost almost 11 pounds, and she's like, I think I might go vegan. What do you think? <laughs> 
<laughs> and then <laughs> and then I remembered the red me and I was just like, She's like oh. I was like, sister, I think you're just speaking out of your butt right yeah. now. You're just very happy and she's like, Yeah, I don't think I'd be able to do it. One day maybe I'm going to turn all my family into freaking Yeah, there's there's my parents are always like, I don't know how you do it. No, yeah. Like my parents, like they still think um that I have to keep reminding them that I'm not eating meat and they still like they're like, Oh well, my mom's more like, Oh well one day and I'm like, No, mom, this is for life. Yeah. Like, doing, and she's like, Really? Like <laughs> never again? And I'm like, Yeah, mom, that's the point of this. Yeah. Like but yeah, anyways, so yeah, I've lost a total of almost five, pound, five pounds, 4.9 pounds. Um, my sister has lost 17.2 pounds. We'll have a more um, updated weight loss tomorrow. I'll update you guys ASAP. Um, maybe if I lose more this time, I'll be more happy. And I'll be like, okay, let me... <laughs> Let me get this video she in. She has been like so pissed like these past three weeks because she's just like, I am doing everything right and like I'm following everything by the book. But I'm telling her like it's like she like she's already like hitting that like stage where it's like it's going to be even harder for her to like yeah, lose weight. It's, it's my last pounds I need to shed. So I get it. Like I have that in my head, but it's just frustrating you know and more because i have my sister over here losing all this weight and i'm like and i need here. to remind her that i have more fat which i'm aware of obviously like at first i was like you know losing a ton of weight too and it's, it's gonna get slower and, and yeah. i'm aware of that it's just i just i'm not happy with the progress yeah but i'm hanging on tight you guys i'm i'm gonna do this i'm gonna complete this you got this, sister. I got this. got this. We got this. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, anyways, um, we went pretty long, very long yeah. on this video. So I hope we didn't bore you guys. Make sure you, sh you show some support to my sister because she's doing amazing. Mm -hmm. I'm so proud of her. I'm glad that she finally is deciding to do something for herself. So... <laughs> so yeah. <Thank> you. <laughs> are you gonna cry right now? No, I don't know why my eyes are so mm, watery. We're such crybaby, so I wouldn't doubt if I've been so emotional these like like since my sister started her journey, like I would tell her how proud I am of her and I would just start <laughs> running I would just start crying because I'm like so proud of her. Like I'm gonna cry right now. <laughs> Stop. Yeah, she'd be like, sister, I'm so proud yes. of you. Like, it's... And then she'd get teary and be like, Why are you crying? <laughs> I just, Aww. I just, I'm so proud of you, sister. Aww, thank you, sister. <laughs> I'm proud of you, too. <laughs> well, clearly, I'm not that big of a crybaby. Uh, yeah, I don't know what's been wrong with me. I've been an emotional very... mess, but yeah. <laughs> it's okay, we have each other. For those of you that are struggling out there, you can do it. My sister can do it. You can do yes. it. Trust me. <laughs> yeah, because I'm... Yeah, I'm weak. I am very She's weak. weak. And just remember that we all love food. Everyone loves food. I love food. I mean, even though alcohol is a bigger weakness <laughs> for me, but I love food. Everyone loves food. It's just a matter of sacrificing some things for a moment yes. and then, you know, getting back up on your feet and doing this for yourself, not for anyone else, just to feel better for yourself. So. Yes. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you guys, or we will we'll see, see you guys. Yes. Until next time, love you guys. Who's that sexy thing?